Hey guys today in this video I'm going to show you how to troubleshoot the laptop power on. But no display showing. If your laptop's warranty has expired, though, use a few simple steps to troubleshoot the laptop and determine whether you can repair the unit yourself. Follow my all step don't skip the video. So without wasting time let's start it. When I press and hold the power button of the laptop, the power is turned on but the display of the laptop is not on. So how do you fix the display problem? First you disconnect all external connected peripheral devices such as USB storage devices, external displays, and printers. Thereafter you'll need to fully turn off your laptop and then unplug the power adapter. Remove the battery from the battery compartment. With the battery and power cord unplugged, press and hold the power button for about 15 to 20 seconds to reset the CMOS battery configuration. After that, turn on your laptop without even using the battery and by just attaching the power cable only. Most of the times this will completely reset your BIOS and now you are able to run your laptop just like as it was before. In case, if you still seeing the blank screen then it's possible that the above given procedure doesn't work on your laptop's model and then. Now you'll need to deassemble your laptop in order to properly reset the BIOS by removing the CMOS battery for about 5 seconds. If your problem is still not solved then follow the next step. Commonly, 90% of you people will fix your problem by following this step. I'm only saying. Because RAM is the one who easily get dirty due to age or bad moistures surrounding. And. Not just that, it's also possible that your RAM got dead too. Unplug all the power source like a battery or power adapter. Now open your laptop's back panel case, where actually the RAM is located. Open the back panel of the laptop with a screwdriver as I am opening it. The way I open the back panel of the laptop, you open the back panel of the laptop in the same way, you can open the back panel by tapping with your hands. After opening the back panel of the laptop and then remove the RAM from its RAM slot. Open the RAM the way I am opening the RAM from the slot and follow the way I am opening the RAM. After that, you'll need to clean your laptop's RAM properly. How to clean RAM Take an eraser and clean the RAM in the same way that I clean it. Now it's time to put the RAM back in its place. In case, if you have two RAM stick installed in your computer then you can try to remove one of them and then turn on your laptop. If your PC still won't work, then just remove the RAM from its slot and then install another one on that same RAM slot. If your computer still won't able to work out, then just repeat the previous steps on the other RAM slot of your laptop. If there is a problem with the laptop, even after cleaning the previous RAM, then 80% RAM can be a problem. To fix the problem, you need extra RAM of the same model, you can get the RAM of the same model from a friend or someone else. I have extra RAM, so I will check the laptop with extra RAM, whether I have a problem with RAM or not, it is a problem with RAM in the maximum case. In this case I had a problem with my laptop's RAM, in your case, but not RAM may be a problem and clean, and install your previous RAM well, your problem will be solved. If you find your RAM faulty, then believe it or not, but cleaning it can increase the chance 80% that it will work again in your computer. After installing the RAM on the laptop, insert the battery to see if the laptop is turned on. When it is turned on, then insert the back panel of the laptop. I have already turned it on, so I will put the back panel of the laptop first, put the back panel and turn on the laptop. If you still have problems with this, you should go to the nearest computer repair shop. Now turn on the laptop, by pressing the power button now you can see for yourself that your laptop will be turned on without any problem. I hope this video helped you. 
please share it with your friends also. If you have any doubts related to this, let us know in the comment box below. If you liked the video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the channel.